Hey guys, this is Nate from Bro Lighting. I wanted to get on today and just talk about something that has just really gotten under my skin lately to see if we can all make a change, make a difference in this industry together. Over the weekend, uh, you know, it's like three o'clock, four o'clock in the morning and I'm lying awake in bed and I could not sleep because I was just so fired up about this. And it's that this industry is broken. The current supply model for the lighting industry is broken and we can do so much better and we are doing so much better here at Brilled. And it's something I want to talk about a little bit. So I don't know how many of you saw my post uh, last week or the week before. One of our current customers, they're a little construction supply company out in Tennessee. They reached out to me. They needed a specific fixture. And you know how jobs go. They've got a very specific thing spec'd out. Sometimes you don't really have an alternate option for that. Then they had called the manufacturer directly to see, hey, can I source this fixture? What kind of pricing can I get? And of course the manufacturer said, nope, you have to, have to be a distributor. So they reached out to me and said, hey, can you help us out? Can you do something to help us get what we need? I called the manufacturer. He said, oh, well, you have to call the rep. So I called the rep. The rep said, oh, we won't set you up as a distributor, even though we're a lighting company in their state. You have to call the local dealer. Okay, fine. There's multiple local dealers anyway. It's not exclusive. I called the local dealer. In this case was Codel, um, among others here up in Logan. And the pricing they give me after all day of waiting is $356 for a 30 watt wall pack fixture. Guys, it's ridiculous. The, the point isn't how many channels it went through, all that's broken. The point is that fixture isn't worth that kind of money. A 30 watt wall pack isn't worth 350 plus dollars. That's before I even put any kind of markup on it. I could give it to him for cost. I make nothing. Just do it as a favor for my guys and he's still paying an unfair price. It just doesn't make sense. The industry is broken. We are trying to change that at Brill. So here's, here's the thing. This industry is full of good people and bad. I'm not going to say all manufacturers reps are bad. All distributors bad. I, that's just not true. People who don't add value are bad. That's what's broken in the supply chain. Manufacturers reps are good in the sense that they get, they get a product out there. They educate people. Uh, you know, if they do their job, they can be awesome. I've met some good reps. We don't work through reps here at Brill Lighting because it's an additional level of the supply chain. But I'm not saying all reps are bad. The problem is you have a lot of reps out there that are waiting to the last second to give you pricing to see if they can do some Weasley stuff in the back end and find how they can make the biggest possible markup without you know, really knowing what the costs are. They're always trying to increase their profit margin. You have distributors out there who, especially during COVID, aren't even stocking products, some of them. I want you to pre-order online, wait the 60 days for manufacturing. Well, then what kind of value did you add? If you're a distributor and you're not even stocking local in your brick and mortar, what was your value add? You just sold the product. You were just an order taker. That's not adding value. That's what's broken our supply chain. Here at Brilled with all of our partners, our manufacturing conglomerate partners, all the way down to our end customers even, we try and create true partnerships. And every time we contact anybody, we make sure that we're adding value. We never just take an order and, and move on. What's the point of that? So here's my thing. The supply chain right now, it's broken, guys. It is so broken, it needs to change. It's five, six people long, sometimes worse. I'm talking about Factory Direct. That's what we're trying to do here at Brilled. That's what a lot of other good people here in the industry are trying to do. Be a part of it with us. Be the part of this movement away from non-value added services towards the price the customer pays. They pay for all the value along the way. They don't pay for all the bull crap that they're going through to get this product through way too many channels. It goes from manufacturer to customer or from manufacturer to the local distributor to the customer. Two or three long supply chains. None of this crap of five and six people down the line. You know, and of course we have some partners that sell to contractors. And so you might have a four long supply chain on occasion. That's okay. Again, it's about adding value down the road. Help us change this industry. We've been quiet about it till now. We haven't made a big stink. We tried to be nice. I, I'm done being nice. Let's stop accepting the fact that, oh, this is just how it is. You have to go through these channels because some big guys with some big power in the industry are trying to force our hand. We can make a difference. We can make a difference today. We can make it better for our customers and for our staff and for ourselves. Everyone can have a better experience, make better money, 
and just have an overall better industry. We can get there. I believe that, but we've got to stop being nice about it. And so uh, here at Brill, you're going to hear a lot more about this from us. We're pushing the factory direct model. We're pushing uh, these special new partnerships in our manufacturing conglomerate, which we've co-founded with Techno LED to do something different. Tune in for more. Thanks for watching, guys. And I uh, hope to talk to you again soon.